differentiation of algebraic and trigonometric functions. In this video, we will discuss the standard formula that can be used to find the derivatives of algebraic and trigonometric functions. First, consider an algebraic function f of x equals to x raised to n. To find the derivative of this algebraic function, just multiply the function with its degree and reduce the degree of the function by 1. Therefore, the derivative of x raised to n with respect to x is n into x raised to n minus 1. Let us understand this formula with the help of an example. Suppose we want to find the derivative of the function f of x equals to 3x raised to 4. Using the standard formula, we can write the derivative of 3x raised to 4 as 3 into 4x raised to 4 minus 1 equals to 12x cube. Therefore, the derivative of 3x raised to 4 is 12x cube. Now consider 6 trigonometric functions sin x, cos x, tan x, cosec x, sec x and cot x. The derivative of sin x is cos x. The derivative of cos x is minus sin x. The derivative of tan x is sec squared x. The derivative of cosec x is minus cosec x cot x. The derivative of sec x is sec x tan x. The derivative of cot x is minus cosec squared x. The best way to remember the derivative of trigonometric functions is first alternate the positive and negative signs. Then alternate the first two functions that is sin x and cos x. Then pair the alternate trigonometric functions that is tan x and sec x and cosec x and cot x. Now consider the first pair that is tan x and sec x. Take one tan x and two sec x like this. To find the derivative of tan x or sec x just remove that function and multiply the other two functions. This means that the derivative of tan x would be sec squared x and the derivative of sec x would be sec x tan x. Do the same with the other pairs. To find the derivative of cosec x or cot x, just remove that function and multiply the other two functions. This means that the derivative of cot x would be cosec squared x and the derivative of cosec x would be cosec x cot x. So this is how you can remember the derivative of trigonometric functions. Let us now discuss an example to understand these formulas. Suppose we want to find the derivative of the function f of x equals to 3 sin x plus 2 tan x. Using the standard formula, we can write the derivative of 3 sin x as 3 cos x and the derivative of 2 tan x as 2 sec square x. Therefore, the derivative of 3 sin x plus 2 tan x will be 3 cos x plus 2 sec square x. So this is how we differentiate the algebraic and trigonometric functions. 